What's up, everyone? You are watching YouTube Live with Toya and Bella. This week, we are making the July newspaper. <laughs> Fashionably late, of course, but it literally went to print like five minutes ago. So that's the only reason why this is so late and it's not on the blog. I mean, we didn't make a post about it, but it is available on our blog, myfrogystuff.blogspot.com. In the album, books and school stuff, we have the July newspaper available and with new articles for the dollhouse to keep all of you dollies informed. And today we're gonna to do a question and answer. And while we are doing that, I'm going to whip together a couple of newspapers, if you don't mind. So the newspaper on the blog is in color. It's in color, but I like to print it on black and white or grayscale, because for me that just feels like a newspaper. Even though newspapers have color print now, but I just like the black and white. So you can print it in color, or you can choose to print it in black and white. It's up to you. There are two sizes available for 18 to 24 inch dolls and for our 10 to 12 inch dolls. And if you want it for a smaller doll, just use your printer to shrink it and you can make it for your calico critters and LL surprise dolls. Yeah. All right, so what's up, Kristen Kennedy? How you doing? What's up, uh, Deanna? How you doing? Hola to Hawaiian Lili. Aloha. Was that Aloha? Yeah. I. It was with an L. They said Hola Aloha. Oh, dude, I am so jacked up. I am sorry, but Ola that's what you're Spanish. here to correct Aloha me. Is Hawaiian. So which one was it? Aloha. Aloha. I thought I it spelled. So. It was spelled. Hola. Like Spanish. I could have. I could be wrong. Okay, it's been a day. <laughs> so, what's up to I am IDK, IDK, I don't know, I don't know. Is that right? Mm -hmm. IDK means I don't know? Yes. All right. What's up to Crafty Katie? Shout out to QQ Sue. What's up, Cora Bennett Barnett? How you doing? Okay, so we're going to do as many questions as we can. This time, we're going to go fairly quickly to try to answer as many questions as we can. So we have questions on Instagram, we have questions questions on the community tab on YouTube, and you all can drop questions in the comments right here live. Shout out to Maddie. What's up, Maddie? Okay, here we go. While you're doing that, I'm gonna make newspapers. First one, what's your favorite color? Black, go. I don't know. This is literally rapid fire, I the have first no idea. question. <laughs> <laughs> um, right now, it's like, Purple, yellow, and like a runny orange ish. Okay, yeah. nice. Not fast, but yeah. Okay, so if you printed out the newspaper, we're just gonna cut out both groups of uh, pages here. All right, so what's your favorite fruit? Uh, right now, I'm all about them apricots. They are, there are so many different types of apricots, I had no idea. There's like white ones, and then there's like some. Other ones, there's some with like they're more pink on one side and yellow on the other, and I'm loving the apricots right now. That's me. What about you? I like avocado. Technically, but that's I a hate fruit. guacamole. Well, it's okay. You like the natural fruit. Yeah. Well, it's not like guacamole is bad. It's just like I'm kind of sick of it. Oh. But yeah. Okay. How old are you guys, dude? In our birthday bash. When we painted our paint party, we talked about our birthdays. So you are free to share yours, but I'm not sharing mine again. I'm 15. And I'm older than that. I told you my age that day. That's all I'm doing. Oh, uh, what camera do you use to record? Right now, we are on a tablet. Normally, I am recording with... I think it's a Canon. It's a expensive camera that I despise and it despised me. We have a very much love-hate situation going on and um, it does everything it can to make my life miserable. That's how I feel about my camera right now. So I would much rather use like a cell phone or something else. But my camera is like, it's a Canon something. Dude, I can't even tell you, but I don't like it, but I use it. Okay. Uh, what's your favorite, the favorite doll that I own? Right now, the custom Mini Toya and Mini Bella are my favorites. I also really like the Summer and Cali dolls because I love the Integrity Toy faces. I did put them on Made to Move Bodies, though. 
<laughs> you know me, come on. Uh, shout out to Art Hernandez. What's up? Oh my goodness, that's a hummingbird. Sorry. <laughs> Did you see that? It was like I saw something. At first, I thought it was like a giant moth. I was like, wait a minute, that's that's a hummingbird. Okay. Someone said, "What's your favorite dog? Favorite dog breed?" Okay, so the dog talk again, right? Okay, so I am I'm gotten I've gotten a lot better now talking about dogs. I am okay with. With Caspian being gone. Oh, we're just talking about that I'm, one. I know. I'm just Girl, saying. let's talk about the other one. I'm okay. <laughs> I finally, I've stopped. I can say his name without crying now. But I am very hopeful to get a puppy one day. Um, and the puppy that I want. We should, it's a surprise. Can we give it a surprise? Why? Because surprises are awesome. We can build up the anticipation. Why don't we do that? As we you know, but, but this dog give is a very trailer. unusual. And I don't want to hear any negativity about my Oh puppy. my god, who cares what people say? Well, just know that we got a puppy coming. I'm not going to say what it is. Can I say what it it's is? It's a surprise. Why? It's a surprise. Oh my god. I love surprises. Okay? And and uh, I'm getting a puppy. Hopefully soon. Hopefully soon. And uh, when I say soon, it's like two months. Yeah. That's <laughs> the closest we could find. So, literally, we were, like, called the lady, the lady today, and she was like, oh, I'm sorry, they're gone. And we were like, what are we going to do now? I was all sad. I was like, but you know what? All in good time, because right now, we are actually supposed to be doing some work, and the puppy would be a distraction. But I want a puppy! So, husband, or my dad out there, which one of the one of you is watching? I want a puppy. So, you know... Just saying. <laughs> uh, what's your favorite song? Uh, Cabin Fever by Jin Smith. I've watched, I've listened to it like, I listen to it like 10 times straight. Like, just on loop. It's a fantastic song. Once you cut out your pieces, you're going to use, you're going to use a glue stick and you're going to glue them back to back. Make sure you got the top on both of them. So you don't end up with like one upside down. So we're doing that next. My favorite song right now is I'm all about the labyrinth. You got this labyrinth vibe going on. And I love the um the David Bowie song when he's uh dance, magic dance. I actually have that on my playlist. So, so what are your thoughts on Avatar the Last and Airbender? I watched it like one in at seventy five percent times. I watched the whole thing, like, years ago, and I don't remember it. We watched it... And then like, we watched it with y'all. We bought it, like, a few years ago. We like, did. two years ago, we bought it and we watched it. No one watched the whole thing without yeah. us. We were watching it all together. I, I didn't finish it, though. Yeah, initially. I didn't finish the second time. But then it got on Netflix, and then the hype happened again, and everyone <laughs> remembered about it and remembered it. And then I watched it again. Uh, but I didn't finish it. Because... I, I, I watch like six shows at the same time. I don't see how you do that. Like, just commit to one and finish it. Because I'd be like, Bella, you want to watch this show? You're like, oh, I'm halfway through that, but I'm watching this and I'm watching that. And it's like impossible to watch a show with you. Yeah. So that's just where that is. Um, how do you feel about 90s music? What is I mean, 90s music? Yeah, I mean, what 90s music is like... Uh, which, which genre you deal with, with OPP, yeah, you know me. I don't even know what that song was about, to tell you the truth. Um, <laughs> there was like, uh, I don't know. I don't really listen to 90s music, unless it's a soundtrack. Because I'm all about the sound soundtracks. Samsung or Apple? Apple. Apple. <laughs> don't even have to think on that one. Unless you're Samsung and you're watching, I would love some sponsorship. <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, what's up to Astronaut, Ladybug, and Beyond? Show us the baby Yoda. Oh, yeah, it's my little baby. So, uh, last time when we had this out, she told me to stop. So, I, I start putting him back there because I had him doing all kinds of stuff. And I even have another one over here. This one makes sounds. But he's so much smaller. So, we just put him back here. And then this one makes sounds. Oh my god. Together they're perfect. Okay. <laughs> uh, it's, that question was too long. I couldn't Someone read it. said, do you put pineapple on pizza? Back in the day when we used to eat pizza, yes. Of course. Who doesn't put pineapple on pizza? Now we put collard greens on pizza. No, you don't. 
Yeah, we do. We put Not on pizza. We put collard greens on everything. I put collard greens on my pancakes. She puts collard greens on pancakes. Don't judge me. It tastes good. You know what? I don't. They I don't, hate me because they hate me. Everyone has a different taste palette. You know, so whatever you like. How do you make DIY Barbie pillows? We have a billion videos on um, bedding. And a lot of times when we'll do a room, we'll do the bedding in that room. So if you're looking for my party, of bedding that might be difficult to find. But if you go to like one of our rooms, like especially our college room, I, I think, you can find where we make the bedding and everything in the video. What's your favorite movie? My favorite movie is The Labyrinth. I love the David Bowie. Um, I also really like anything Star Trek related, like Captain Picard, the, any of his movies. I watch those repeatedly. What about you? His movies? How was the show? <laughs> I don't know why they got me so triggered all of a sudden. <laughs> yeah, he has movies. Star Trek Nemesis, come on! We got like two Picards, kind of, sort of. One was like a fake clone. Best. Uh, what about you? I don't know. I don't watch a lot of movies. Can you make a washing machine? Oh, yes. The Old Guard. Love that movie. The Old Guard My was My favorite movie awesome. on the entire planet, like, ever. Is like, the Old Guard. Is the Old Guard. Okay, so, the Old Guard is incredibly violent. So, just throwing that out there. It's, it's very, very violent. But. Oh, yeah. It's, if you want to see some. I literally forgot about all that. Yeah, there's some crazy stuff in there. There's some ladies throwing them things. And uh, hands. I love it. So yeah, the old guard is that's amazing too. Okay, so once you've glued your two sides together, together, give it a second to dry. So we're just gonna set that there and let it dry. What's up? So do you, you love cats? Do you love cats? Not really. But Ooh. you know, if I were to get a cat, it'd be a sphinx. I love cat videos. I do watch cat videos and cat memes all day long. I follow an account on Instagram called Cuddle Clones, and they have all of these amazing animal things, mainly dogs, but it's just hilarious to me. I love it. Um, YouTube Live, I'm looking for more questions. All right, where did, when did you start YouTube? We started YouTube in 2010. Well, we started my froggy stuff in 2010. I had a channel two or three years before that. Um, but it was like a personal me playing around, but that's how we got started. And then when I decided to get serious, we gave ourselves an actual YouTube-ish name, and that's when my Fargy stuff came around. How can I contact you on Instagram? On Instagram, I am usually in the comments of my most recent post. So if you, if I upload a post or you get a notification, I'm usually hanging out in the comments for a few minutes after that, answering here and there, and and then. I'm probably working again or off to somewhere. I don't answer my DMs, like, probably ever. So, I'm really, really bad. Shout out to Old Chi. What's up? Favorite smart doll. My favorite smart doll. I think it's the one I haven't unboxed yet. Um, I have Nostalgia. And I'm going to unbox that one as soon as I can because she's just sitting there waiting to be unboxed. And then I saw they have blue ones coming. There's like alien smart dolls. And I'm just like, what? But smart dolls are so expensive. You've got to slow down, Danny. Please. <laughs> because I'm going to go broke. And uh, I want these certain smart dolls, but they just cost so much. So I have to wait. DC or Marvel? Ugh, Marvel? Wonder Woman. But Wonder Woman's DC. But that's just one movie. True. Everything else is not that good. Okay, I'm going to say Marvel. But DC cartoons were Marvel cartoons. I want to just take Wonder Woman and put her in the Marvel Universe. Or just give DC to Marvel. <laughs> yes. <laughs> and I'm going to have, Matt, I'm gonna have and crossovers. Crossovers of DC Marvel. That is like the ultimate wish list, which will never probably happen. But that's what I would love. Uh, do you have any um, Littles Pet Shops? Yeah, we have lots and lots of Littles Pet Shops. Um, I've collected them through their many phases and many different makeovers <laughs> um i haven't gotten so many lately but i i do have a few i knew that i saw some pictures floating around saying that they got some new ones coming out so that sounds pretty awesome uh what's up my froggy stuff crew what's up who's your favorite barbie my favorite barbie doll is you but i'm a custom so does that even count yes um if i'm looking at just a regular favorite barbie wonder woman Yes, Wonder Woman is my favorite. 
We just need to get a full articulate meeting body. And then we're good! Okay, what's your favorite sport? There's such a thing called sports? Oh, volleyball. No. Okay, then so volleyball. Volleyball is only good in anime. <laughs> <laughs> I actually played volleyball in high school and I got hurt. I got injured pretty bad. But um, other than that, I'm not a big sports person, but haiku all day, every day. I'll watch volleyball all day if it's Karasuno. Karasuno. If it's Karasuno. Yeah, and season, like, they had a season three where it's, or, what's season, yeah, it was season three. But it's, like, two episodes. And it wasn't Karasuno? No, it was, it like, was, it was the other, te other team. I was like, I don't want to know about no other team. I'm sorry, Shira Toyizawa. <laughs> That's it. That was it. They weren't even, even in that. Were, that was, it was, that was a training camp. <laughs> Oh, whatever. Uh, shout out to Amber's mom. What's up? Can you remake the room you're streaming in, but the mini-verse for Mini Toy and Mini Bell? Yes, actually, I've started on that room twice. And I've lost the footage twice. <laughs> so, I don't know if that's, like, the universe talking to me. So, I don't know. Well, I've got to start over again. And uh, this time we're going to probably just make it a little simpler. Because at first I was doing the whole outside build and everything. And uh, the footage kept getting lost. So, we're going to try it again. As soon as we can. Who's your favorite YouTuber? My favorite YouTuber? I like D'Angelo Wallace. His, his, his videos are like podcasts. I've been just dragging people. It's the best. And Stephanie Sue. I love commentary channels. I know, but the... the, 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 the Subject matter of Stephanie Sue's stuff. Oh, is, it's 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 just true crime. It's like crime, and that's it's. Hmm, There's it's just different. Um, my favorite YouTubers right now, I'm gonna say is, you got me loving Jackie Ina. I love Jackie Ina. You do. You got me loving Jackie Ina. I really like Naturals eighty five because she helps me with my hair, and uh, Tracy Hines is forever there because you know she's a living Disney princess. Uh, shout out Someone to said you have Lily. A nice accent. I have an accent. I have an American accent. I do. I have one. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I used to have a really, really thick Valley Girl accent. I don't even know where that came from. You didn't even grow up in the Valley. <laughs> I didn't. I left when I was four. So <laughs> when I was little, it was like so hardcore. And then Clueless came out, and I was like, oh, yeah, okay. As if. As if. You couldn't talk to me. I was like Cher all day, every day. But Cher is literally like a spirit animal, so I know. who cares? But I've calmed down, and I've tried to be calmer. Someone said, where did Bella get her shirt? It's hers. I stole it. Bella often shops in my closet, and then doesn't give it back. <laughs> or it has bleach stains on it. If you could get any pet you wanted, what would it be? Dog. Yeah. Absolutely. I don't have any interest in any other animal. Pretty much. Or I already have, I already have a horse, so. How long does it take to make a film? Uh, unboxings can take me one to two days, depending on how much product I'm covering and how distracted I am. Crafting takes two to four days, usually, because there's a lot of trial and error. You love my shirt, my labyrinth shirt. There we go. Someone said, does Bella miss school? Absolutely not. <laughs> I do kind of want school to hurry up and start so we can just rip off the band-aid, but oh, it's they pushed like the date back, so I only have like half of August to go through and then September. So yeah, well, school um, sucks. I don't don't want to go back, but you know, online school isn't half bad. I'm not seeing anyone, so <laughs> okay then. <laughs> Hello, antisocial. Um, what are we talking about today? Today we're doing a question and answer, and we went. Oh, we are making our newspaper. In just a second, we'll talk about what's on the newspaper. Um, so, any so tips on getting followers on Dollstagram? Consistency. That's my advice for everything. I just say constantly keep producing content all the time, or people will forget about you. So, so what's your favorite movie series? Movie series is Fast and the Furious. Star Trek. It's every the third one. Tokyo Drift. It's not like, you know. Well, the driving was really cool. But everything else was fine. <laughs> <laughs> the driving was really cool. <laughs> uh, does Froggy Boy ever ride Johnny? No. He is allergic no. to hay. He's allergic to hay, yeah. He's allergic to hay, so he doesn't come to the barn with us much anymore. Um, Peyton wants to know, what powers does Summer have? 
Summer's powers have not been revealed, or if she even has them. But we just know she has the gene, but we don't know what her powers are yet. Um, I know what her powers are, but that's a surprise. What's your so, favorite food? Yet. What's my favorite food? I really like snickerdoodles. But the only ones that my dad makes. Yes. <laughs> That's when we're allowed to get a little, well, these maple sugar, which is like crystallized maple syrup. Basically. So it's not really sugar, kind of, sort of. But someone said, what's a weird thing about you? A weird thing about us? Mm -hmm. uh, my fingers do like kind of weird things. I got a really cool thumb that bends backwards. What about you? Um, I don't know. Okay, <laughs> moving on. Um, what happened to your Froggy Fresh doll? We are no longer affiliated with the Fresh Dolls. All right, um, how many dolls have you collected up till now? I don't know. I've never counted. Who is your bias in BTS? Jungkook and Taehyung. Will Summer and Callie be mermaids? Summer and Callie are aliens. <laughs> so if you've been watching Summer and Callie, we kind of came up we understand now what they have going on, so check that out. Um, I love Summer and Kelly. Who does the voices on Summer and Kelly? I do, and she does. So I play all the characters except for Kelly. She covers Kelly, and I try to get some help. Say, hey, Bells, would you like to do some other characters? And your answer is no. <laughs> so. I do all the characters on Summer Cat. I don't. I can only do my voice. Like I'm not an actress. <laughs> you know, whatever makes you comfortable. If I, I were, wanna... if I were actually like a Hollywood actor, I'd be like a Kevin Hart, like the same, same, the same character in all those movies. But we are not insulting Kevin Hart. No, it's a great character. We love him. <laughs> so, um, you know, but I don't mind. I just whatever she's willing to do, whatever she wants to do, I'll encourage it. She's not interested. I don't push it so much. <laughs> uh, do you like Hamilton? Still haven't seen it. It's like a period piece. What's right? your favorite book? I don't really like plays. That's such a general statement. To well, just no, I, I like watching movies. I don't like watching plays. Like at least on tape. I'd be down for like in person. But, oh, like, okay, gotcha. You would watch a play live. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Gotcha. Um, what's up, Raymond Moore? What's up? What's your favorite, favorite book? My favorite book is Elephant and Piggy Man. They're easy and fast to read. Uh -huh. <laughs> I'm just joking. Um, right now, I don't have a favorite book. I don't know. I haven't really... I don't, mm. The only thing I've been reading is my driver's test manual. Yeah, no. <laughs> it's like, yeah. How to Needle Felt Without Stabbing Your Fingers. That's kind of Pinterest stuff I'm reading right now. It's a great book. Uh, yeah. Picture book. Okay, um... Can you make a candy or th dessert themed room? We did! So when we made our Vanellope Von Sweets custom doll, we made a room for her and she has like a, a ice cream sandwich bed. So we have all kinds of like that in there. Check that video out. Can you review the Star Wars dolls? I think I did a photo review on Instagram for the Wookiee. I don't have the other ones. The Wookiee is the only one I have. And we just did a photo review on Instagram for that. So check it out on Instagram if you want to see what that doll looks like. Uh, what's up, Lauren? How you doing? Shout out to Lily. How you doing? All right, next question. Uh, what's your favorite t-shirt? I think I wear this all the time. I have this one, and then I have the dark crystal, and then my other favorite is probably the, um, my Star Trek cat. I have, a, I have an oversized Dragon Ball theme. Dragon Ball Z t-shirt. Yeah, you do like that one. That one's a nice one, too. Okay, next question is, who is your all-time favorite anime character? Uh, Asahi. That's hard. Asahi? Asahi! Well, you've only seen, like, two anime. And he hasn't got any screen time in the season I'm in right now. Just season saying. Four, yeah. Season 4 is the best season, though. Asahi is my favorite right now. Actually, it's not. And I liked Daichi a whole lot better in the dubbed version. Don't be saying that aloud. I, I will say it, okay? <laughs> I like dubbed, okay? <laughs> I want to listen, watch anime, and like draw or well, yeah, sew. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I can't do that if I'm reading subtitles. So I like dubbed. 
And I got really used to watching the show dubbed, and then it wasn't dubbed, and I was, now I gotta read. So, what books do I like? Anime. Manga? <laughs> No, <laughs> the oh. subtitles. <laughs> reading subtitles. That's, That's what funny. I do. Um, what's your favorite color? And my favorite. We well, did that one. Favorite black. color is black. Favorite food is uh, apricots. I don't know. My you have a son. Changing. Yes, I have a son. His name is Noah, and he introduced us to a lot of anime. My husband does too. Both of them are like crazy about anime. Uh, I only like really non-violent anime, which limits my type of anime yes. a lot. So, but I like, I like, um, the old guard. I like weird anime. It's weird because I can watch John Wick, which is incredibly violent, but I can't watch violent anime. I have a, I have a terrible taste in anime. Like, absolutely She awful. does. <laughs> it's the it's worst. so bad. <laughs> I do not I watch. watch the good ones. Like, I watch My Hair Academia and, like, Animal Punch Man, like, the good ones, you know? Yeah. But then I watch some, I watch some of those really bad ones. No, too. no, no. We're not even going there. Okay, can you make a Pusheen inspired room, please? We did a cat lover room, which has some Pusheen elements in it. It has like a Pusheen rug and stuff like that. So if you're looking for something right now that is available, as for doing a just a Pusheen room, room, we can definitely add that to the list. Shout out to Anne Ansley. Do you speak What's up? any other languages other than English? No. I'm taking French this year. But that doesn't mean I'll be able to speak it. That just means that I'll pass. Because Google Translate and all. <laughs> Why do you tell all your business? <laughs> okay. What's up, Julia? How you doing? Uh, can you make a Lego Friends room? You mean like a Barbie who loves Lego Friends? Or a room to fit Lego Friends? Which one are you interested in? Let me know in the comments down below. Okay. It says, we would like to know if when you were shooting Craftopia, did any of the kids know who you were? Uh, I don't recall anyone actually, like, saying anything. But it was like, Craftopia was this insane experience. Because everywhere you looked, it was like eye candy. There was, like, crafting supplies everywhere, pretty lights. It was just so distracting. So um, the kids, when that came in, they were kind of like, my father said, who? There's a pool of glitter over there. And so, uh, you know, I don't know what they were thinking, but Craftopia was an insane very very sensory experience and uh i'm sure they were really focused on the craft at hand someone said uh star trek or doctor who star trek <laughs> star trek or star wars star trek <laughs> come on old star wars or new star wars i uh, say old star wars well, when you, say, diversity, when you say old Star Wars, do you mean like I mean, they first the, came out or the second wave? Because there's been three waves. I mean, the, there's three, one, the two, first three. three and then the prequels. So you, you the, like... The first six. So you like The Phantom Menace? No. But... <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I feel like they're better than the new ones. Uh, I didn't mind the new ones with Finn and all them. I like them. I feel like the actually. old ones definitely lack diversity. But if the old ones had that more diversity, then... Actually, probably. they've always all had... Because you, you had diversity in all... Can you in stop? The, in the old ones? I think Star... I mean, the aliens. <laughs> Star Wars has, has has been decent about diversity. You've, you've had a you person, person of, of color. color. <laughs> 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 Let's not go down that route. Okay, Barbie or mini brands? Well, the mini brands are a complement to the Barbie. So... I, I'm a doll person, but I do love the miniatures. I'm going to have to say Barbie. Because without the Barbie, the mini brands, I just got miniatures. But I have nothing to take photos with it. So I need the Barbie. Um, do you like the new My Little Pony toys? I have them. I have not sat down and had time to actually pay attention to them yet. So I need to take a moment to do that. Uh, here is the newspaper. And it's all dry. And I'm going to fold it in half. That's the wrong way. Fold it in half. And now we have a miniature newspaper for our dollies to enjoy. So for this month, we cover a lot of topics about the doll parties on social platforms, mainly Instagram, because that's usually where I hang out. And there is a doll account called Dollstagram Community Events, and they really help to put all of the invitations in one spot so we can know what events are going on. So you can look for a lot of that in this edition of our newspaper. And we talk about some lives so you can be, stay connected. And we talk about one of our favorite doll events that happened this month. So 
new edition of our the Miniverse Times newspaper. Yeah. Anime inspired room. That sounds like fun. It's just your idea of anime, my idea of anime might be two very different things because it might be like a volleyball room. Someone said, do you <laughs> like guacamole? And then are you excited for school? Uh, I, I love don't guacamole. like guacamole because I love when guacamole. we went to New York like two years ago. How many times are you going to tell this? <laughs> we only ate guacamole for like three days. Okay, so that's like when we it were... It was guacamole, rice, and salsa. And we had just become plant... Whole food. Whole plant food. Plant so there was like no food in New York. It was really, it's really difficult traveling Whole Food, but yeah. you know, we made it through and we've done two toy fairs now since then, so you know, it's not so bad. Let it go. Yeah. Do you live in Georgia? Yes, we do. Um, what's the next question? Star Wars or Star Trek? Star Trek. Shout out to... Do you like everything sci-fi dolls. or ka- kawaii theme? Sci-fi. All day. Yeah. All day. I will well, take sci-fi, sci-fi over kawaii. Sci-fi. If, see, okay, a lot of but see the sci-fi culture in the Dollyverse world isn't so strong. So um, we do do a lot more probably of the cutesy stuff over the sci-fi stuff. But if it was up to me, which it kind of is, but still, if it was up to me, this channel would be 100% Star Trek. We would just be in spaceships and living on asteroids and having spacesuits and aliens and everything. That's what we'd be doing. But. Uh, probably lose most of my followers so <laughs> so I like to do a variety of things to make sure everyone gets pretty happy nachos or cupcakes neither neither um if I had to pick between the two though I would probably go nachos without anything on them so it would just be the tortilla chips <laughs> um well you get uh guacamole so tortilla chips and guacamole I can do what, that nachos yeah I wouldn't. Oh. I don't really like nachos. Nachos aren't even nachos with cheese. Well, I don't do, do cheese. cheese. No, I don't do cheese. Um, Barbie doll dog house. I do believe we have lots of dog stuff of, out there. We did a dog house that folds down when the Secret Life of Pets came out. But I am planning on doing a new one because I got puppies on the brain right now, and uh, hopefully we can get to that soon. Barbies are smart dolls. Mmm. I like Barbie size. But I do love the smart doll, but Barbies are smaller, so I'm probably gonna still go Barbie. So I said, what was your first dream job? This. <laughs> the very first. My first dream job? Dream job? Uh yeah, YouTuber. Like as a kid? Because YouTube wasn't that when you were a kid. Well, when I was a kid, I wanted to be a veterinarian okay. until I actually interned as a veterinarian. And I learned I didn't want to be a veterinarian. <laughs> That's how that went. Uh, Playmob- Playmobil or Lego? Lego, Lego, probably. Lego got movies. Well, Playmobil does too. They had a TV show. They have a movie. Oh. Yes. Uh, what's up, Victoria Beckham? How long will you be on YouTube? As long as I possibly can. They will drag me away. Like fingernails. No! Yeah, I'll be here as long as I can. Uh, Princess Leia or Rey? Dude. You can't. No, I'm, I'm not making that choice. Do you watch Umbrella Academy? I tried. I did. It was like a talking chimp. And, uh, Umbrella Academy? I have not. And and then I stopped. <laughs> I never really put it on it either. Did you watch Zombies 2? I have not watched Zombies 2. Dog on cable. Uh, not, no, we have Disney Plus. Steve. Hey. But um, I just, Zombies 1 wasn't like... So I didn't really watch Zombies too. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, which BMR is the best? My favorite one right now is Tango. Now, in the, our BMR review video, um, uh, someone made a comment that the doll's name is not Tango. The doll's name is not Midge. Yes, the doll's names are not that. In fact, they don't have names on the doll packaging or anything. So when I do the BMR videos, I usually refer to them as their face sculpt name. So Tango is the name of the face sculpt on that doll. I like her a lot. And Midge was the name of the face sculpt on that other doll. So I, I thought I'd mention it in the beginning of the video. I hope that's clear in case you were wondering. Barbie or Rain? I don't, I don't know what that one is. Okay, do you make boba tea? I do not. Boba tea? I don't Apparently Taro tastes like kettle corn. That's what my friend said. 
Oh, okay. That was a, isn't it a root? I have no idea. Why is it purple? Have you watched Pup Academy? I did, and it gave me some uh, earbud vibes. Yep, talking puppies, which was cute. I've seen it. Okay. Um, I bet people bet your children are happy. I hope so. Okay. Where's that question? <laughs> I don't think What's your favorite slushy? I don't eat slushies. I've never had a slushy, but never. I've had smoothies. <laughs> but if we're talking smoothies, I'm all about, like, I like orange mango. I like banana mango. I, I like, like anything citrusy. with mango, but I also like banana. But I like strawberry, too. So if you're going to do, like, a strawberry mango with a little bit of orange for that sourness, I'm all there. <laughs> Uh, what's the longest craft you ever did? Kitchens. Whenever I do kitchens, they take forever, and it's probably why I don't do them often. Do you prefer Barbie fashionistas or made-to-move? Made-to-move. All day, every day. I will take one made-to-move Barbie. If all I can have is one, it's going to be a made-to-move. Definitely. Uh, are you going to do American Girl video? I don't have any new American Girls right now, at this moment. Can you make boba tea for dolls? We did boba's in like a smoothie type thing oh my gosh, in a video but that's in a doll such smoothie a good video we did mean, such a good idea yeah we did it already we, we did we, when moana came out boba tea I'm well we called it tea. we called it um with like technology. doll smoothies with the little black balls yeah, yeah, yeah yes yeah. that's in the video it's like it's doll smoothie oh. can i play star stable with you um sure i'll let you know next time i'm logging on i'll just put a note on instagram saying hey I'm going into Star Stable. I'm in the Night Star server, but I haven't been in a minute. My horses are probably really unhappy. But I probably have so much money. I'm sure we have so many star coins. It's gonna. I'm interested to go see what it looks like. Did they make Barbies that look like you? No, we do not have official My Froggy stuff Barbie dolls. What I did was I took Barbie dolls and I made them look like us. So what state do you live in? We live in Georgia. Do you have other YouTube channels? I do. I have Create Something Fabulous, but I haven't posted there in a minute. That doesn't mean you can go watch. <laughs> yeah, it's still there. <laughs> we have lots of Star Stable videos, lots of crafting reviews and whatnot, so those are all there. Roblox or Animal, Cro Animal Crossing? Roblox or Animal Crossing? Um, I was all about the Animal Crossing, and then it just got a little redundant. So, I'm, right now I haven't been playing anything. I'm going to probably say Roblox, but that gets redundant too. But I'm going to say Roblox just because there's so many options for different things you can play. Thanks for hanging out with us, Jupiter TV. Um, what's the next one? Roblox. Someone's like, Roblox. Well, we're building a map in Roblox, so hopefully that will be up and we can do a video on that as soon as we can. What's your favorite custom? Bella and Toya. Those are our favorite customs. Happy early birthday. I didn't see the name, but happy early birthday because your birthday's tomorrow. When are you going to do another Briar Horse video? Right now, I am working on a room that's incorporating stable mates. Um, it's not like a horse room, but it's showing a different way to use stable mates. So I'm working on that video right now, and hopefully that will be done sometime next week. That's my plan. If we take a picture on Instagram, and it's one of your printables, can we tag you guys? I mean, I, I guess. I guess. Yeah, um, shout out to Suki, what's up? And I think it is time to start shout outs because we need to do that. Yes. Okay, here we go, shout out time. We want to give a shout out to Everything Dolls, what's up? Um, Jade Bay, what's up? Shout out to Catstronaut. 45, what's up? Uh, Toy Tunes, what's up? Shout out to Sarah from Littleton, what's up? Uh, Autumn, what's up? <laughs> what happened to my voice? One more time. You, Sarah you from Littleton, what's up? There you go. Okay. <laughs> Coco the Bean, what's up? Um, uh, okay, shout out to Rajan, what's up? Um... Anastasia's World, what's up? Football Frenzy, what's up? Lake E, what's up? Charlie Dog, what's up? Um, Maggie, what's up? Someone said, How tall are you? I'm 5'6. I'm almost 5'4. Almost. What's up, Takira Billy? What's up? L lopping around, what's up? Dory, Ace. Zaccato, what's up? Karen Gorman.
Benjamin, what's up? Maddie's Funs, what's up? Uh, Tim Connell, what's up? Maddie and Michaela, what's up? Uh, two more. Dory, what's up? I said that one. Oh. Uh, uh, Rosa, what's up? Crystal P, what's up? One more, one more, one more. Mm. It's Sky Edits, what's up? And Here Vlogs, what's up? Thank you so much for joining us this week on YouTube Live with Toya and Bella. If you've got HBO Max, don't forget to check out Craftopia. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Don't forget to ring the bell. <laughs> Follow us on Instagram at my froggy stuff and the frog vlog and me on bella of my froggy stuff and our printable newspaper for july is available on our blog myfroggystuff.blogspot.com in the album books and school stuff check it out and stay up on all the mini verse news people we love all of you thank you so much for joining us our kids rock you're awesome we love y'all and we'll see you next week bye